Hello everyone, it's Chris Texera, and let's play another game of the Settlers of Catan on Colonists. We're in the second spot. Let's take a look at this board. All right, so... Well, a couple really obvious spots. That's a really kind of a nice spot over there, that 5, 8, 10. A lot of wheat, some ore. We got the 6, 5, 11 spot in the middle. That could potentially be pretty juicy as well. Um, well, actually, there's 6, 9, 5 here. I take it back. That's, that's even better. Look at that. Six eleven six nine five right there. Probably probably the spot. Otherwise, there is like this nine six four. Yeah. <clears throat> um, I think there's enough wheat in this board too that if we take this, uh, we'll still get some wheat. So yeah, I, I don't think there's much of a danger. No one's I don't think anyone takes this six eleven twelve much more likely this uh six three eleven gets taken maybe they go up to this uh three for one port there's this little sheep colony man that could uh that could be interesting but usually that strategy doesn't work usually that strategy doesn't work um could be a backup strategy for us just in case we need uh we need to do it for like an Orwee sheep game but which is already the favorite to win this game are they are they? We'll see about that. I mean, they're in good position, sure, but I mean, I wouldn't count us out either just yet. We got we got some options here, right? I mean, like this could work. This could work. We'll see. I I do think someone takes this though. I do think the sheep port goes, but. We might need to take the sheep port, so he doesn't take the sheep port. So we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, interesting, interesting map. Very interesting map. Uh, there's also the possibility maybe we do something like the 8 4, get all the resources. So we might be the only person really in position to do that. Maybe getting like the 8 4 3 to the brick port, to the ore port. Yeah, not a surprise on the third spot. I mean, I mean, we'll see. We need to get ports, file. Yeah, I'm I'm kind of with Nilla on this, to tell you the truth. Like, this dude needs to get a port. <clears throat> so either he builds on the port, which could be good riddance, but even then, he's gonna need those eights to roll. Yeah, I mean he's doing his due diligence here, trying to trying to defend. But yeah, I I don't know if this is actually over just yet. Yeah, because if he's gonna play pure wheat sheep. Okay, okay, he's going sheep. Okay. Wow, this is very interesting. So what do we decide to do here? We, we're going to have some options, I think. Really, it really comes down to where red goes. Really comes down to where red goes. I mean, I don't know, man. I... I, I think there's a lot of potential for us like, I know this dude just needs to take, like, this, maybe this 5 8, 10 But, at the same time, like, I don't I don't think we take this. That's the thing. I think we just give it to him. I mean, that's a little little harsh. He probably takes the 5 4 11 just so he gets a little tick more of the aura, maybe? I think... Two one port. I mean, I could, but why would I do that? See, to me, interesting. They go three ten eleven. Go 
could go there. But I don't think we do. I, I think we just take this. Yeah, we're going to go all resources here. We're going to get ports. Going to get resources. Going to be in strong position for the road. I, th I think if you're orange, I do think maybe you go on the 5411. Um, it's not as productive as this, but it stops red from getting an expansion spot. It also gets you a little bit more ore, which, you know, could be pretty important, all things considered. But I mean, I don't know. Like, I think I think blue here is in a little bit of a weak position. He needs this port to get going, right? Red here. Red's got weak brick and ore. We've got strong everything. So I, I'm really liking our position. Really liking our position. I think we're in really good shape. We've also got expansion options, right? We have three ports we could expand to, and they're all ports we could use. Yeah, that, that's what I'd do as well. I think that's right. I think that's right. I think the 11.54 is right, even at the expense of that extra production. Because again, odds are he can get that. Now, we might want to consider doubling back and, and getting that, considering what we can do. We'll pass. I don't have much interest or incentive to help a lot of people at this point. I'm going to need this wood to start rolling. That's going to be a big deal. Wood's going to be the great equalizer on this, on this board. Only two of us have it. Interesting. He needs to cut up. What what makes him think orange is gonna beat him there? I, I just I don't understand. Like, we're not exactly gonna be that interested in helping blue get to this port. He's just making an enemy out of himself. He should go block the nine. Oh, interesting. I was thinking he'd actually go black the nine there. Hmm. Taking his time deciding here. I think he hits us. But probably hits blue because blue's being annoying. <laughs> but I mean, I think strategically. Oh, he, he did. Yeah, he did. Okay. Yeah, I mean, this is one of these things where you move your mouth sometimes, it hurts you. He's going to beat him. Oh, he didn't! Wow, look at that. Man, I, I kind of thought maybe he would just do that to, to screw over... Uh, what's his name? Crazy. Let's see if we can't get a sheep... I'm going to hold. A little risky holding on at that point. Maybe that was the wrong move. But... Yeah, I agree. But he's got to get to the wheat port first. That's the thing. Or the sheep port first. It's not there yet. Yeah, this is the case everybody has the same resources, too. That's the other problem. Big resource diversification problem here. I mean, a two for one deal is pretty good. Let's look at these guys real quick. 51%, 1%. Is that real though? 33. Okay. We get a six. We're going to go ahead straight for the three for one port. We will pass. Get another nine there. Let's look at the rest of these guys. And that dude's got a really nice win percentage. 20% win percentage. And we've got another nice win percentage here. So some pretty good players. 
pretty good players here. What do we got here? We got all kinds of crazy little trades going on. Um, I don't think we're going to do any of them. I want sheep. Hasn't been any sheep. I need sheep. We're just hoping there's no seven here, but it's a little, little dicey until we get that. All right, red's on the board. More brick, man. These these threes have been rolling. Something I do wish in colonists. Maybe maybe someone on the chat knows or uh, on the comments knows. Do you know, if anyone knows, ah, eh, no. If anyone knows how to actually get, that's a whole card for a wood. I'll take it. I'll take the three for one there. Does it mean that alone gets me a settle? And I mean, it doesn't quite get him where he needs to go just yet. It gets me a city too, potentially. Um, we got a lot of cards. Like, I know what he's up to. I know what he's up to. I just, I, wonder, I just wonder if we can take it, but we'll see. All right, we get an 11. Now let's see, how do we want to play this? I think... Do we want city? Or do we want to settle? Eleven, huh? How about that? Let's see. Don't really want to trade with blue, but all right, no. Um I think we go city. Well, I got I gotta be a little careful here. Oh, Jesus. Um, oh, my God. I'm so bad at this. this is, uh, you're all wondering what, what happened. Um, I... Uh, what's my bad, guys? I gotta be honest with you. I think I kind of forgot how colonist controls worked there for a minute. That was a little weird. Um, that was kind of weird. I was like in the process of doing something, but it didn't really work. Um, I don't know why. I thought the control for uh, the the four, the just the what should we call it? I thought the four for one trade was just going to do its thing there. It didn't didn't work. I don't know why. Um, it's been a little while since I played Colonist, so I feel like I kind of hesitated there, and that's my bad. Um, yeah, that sucked. That really sucked. Um, all right, let's try that again. Like, what did I do? Like, why isn't this working? Oh my God, I'm doing it backwards. That's why, ah, oh, I feel so dumb. I feel so dumb. Okay, man, uh, it just goes to show you sometimes, guys. Sheesh, okay, ah, oh, man. Um, why why is my brain not working all right let's just do this we'll take the port i can't believe i did that that is so dumb man i feel stupid it's been a while guys i, I really i gotta play colonists a little bit more often that's where the interface screwed me up and i was thinking it was a little bit more like the other interface you're all watching this like god what a dumb dumb i feel like a dumb dumb there gotta be honest i feel like a dumb dumb all right well blue's in really good shape all of a sudden you're gonna need to slow him down I was wondering if I should have bought some cards instead. Yeah, this is not, not ideal. Man. Would have been such better shape if I could have just built that city or the settle earlier. I don't know why my brain was looking at that like playing things backwards there. Just playing it completely backwards. God, I can't believe I did that. Well, this goes to show you, you can't like delay playing sometimes. Because unless you do, it's just really going to screw you up. That's my bad. 
Really, my bad. Four for one. Gotta hand it to him. I'll say this. This this dude's giving us an interesting, an interesting look at the trade. Like he really knows what he wants to do. Gotta hand it to him. There's there's a lot of um, a lot of respect there. I mean, I would love if a seven rolled. I just don't see. Maybe we can get this. Let's see. We'll pass. But yeah, we need a seven. We need we needed this blue guy to wash out of his cards a little bit, because this is gonna get really dangerous. If he gets that port, it's over. Yeah, it's not gonna be a lot we can do. If he gets that, not gonna be a lot we can do, I think. Because again, it's just it's too strong of a port. All those sheep, we're just gonna have to hit him constantly. <sighs> Need a seven. I mean, I guess I still can't believe he did that. All right. Okay, we're gonna start buying some cards, I think. But this dude's got fifteen cards. I mean, he's gonna get his settle or even a city potentially. I think he goes straight for this. He has to go for the port. Yeah. So now it's like code red. He's already got the car. He's almost got the road. This is this is already like code red. Damn. Okay. Got to hit. No, I don't know about that. I think you got to keep going after blue here on the sheep. We're going to buy a card. All right. VP doesn't really help. I need knights. Need knights. Cannot let this happen. Cannot let this happen. Ah, oh, God. Yeah. Here comes the card buying. All right, there's a nine. Nine is helpful. We needed a nine. See, this is bad. So bad. I mean, he's so close now. He needs one road. Play the knights. It's over. So the eight is the target. It's no question. It's going to be a constant eight attack. I think everyone senses it, which is good, I guess. But... Man, I can't believe we sevened out on the 12 cards there. God, that was, that was like so dumb. I can't believe it, guys. I really can't. I guess this is kind of keeping us in the game here. He probably will move this. It's probably going to move maybe on the 8. But yeah, blue is in such a good position all of a sudden. Somebody needs to play this night. Needs to go here. And again, the problem is he's got more cards than us. It's a tough position. Tough position. Ah, it was all going so well. And then a disaster. Then disaster. Do we give it to him? No. Here comes the seven, uh, the, the knight, no doubt. Oh, it didn't happen. Okay. I wonder if there's an argument here for us to maybe try to take the road first. Kind of assumed he would have played the knight there. He did not. So either he doesn't have a knight. Well, he probably wants to hold it. See, we can't get something. I don't really want to give it to blue. Yeah, orange takes. We'll take the orange. Um, we're gonna build some roads, I think. Let's go. Let's do that. We're just going to put ourselves in a position to maybe take the road. 
There you go. That's where it needs to go. It needs to sit there constantly. And that's right. That's the right placement for it. We really need this three for one port. Really need the three for one port here. This 12. I could have maybe gone for one of these two ports as well. Like filling up on this eight could be pretty important, but I mean, yeah. Okay, red's trying to go for the road now too. But at least this is good. It it puts some pressure on blue. Dude, he didn't have a seven. Wow, he did. I thought I thought he was maybe holding a knight there. He wasn't. That's really interesting. Uh oh. Where does this go? Gonna hit blue. Oh, we got it. Perfect. All right. We needed that. We needed that. Not I perfect, perfect or anything, but it's something. Okay, so I feel like we're back in the game a little bit here. And we need some help. Is this red? Um, no, hold. He does trade with them. He gets the road. Okay. We were the weed port. That's interesting. Okay. Interesting. Get that red, right? We get that. That's good. Another card. Could be pretty dangerous. Knight, not a surprise on the nine. Okay. 12 for us. Let's roll another six. Um, what's happening here? No, no, no. I want... Fives always fail me, yeah. All right, can we get some wheat? Maybe do uh, this for wheat. Orange takes. We'll take. We'll use that. We'll get another city. We'll get this. All right. It's something that gets us on the board. Maybe we can really explode our road production with this. It's kind of the hope. We'd love to get back to this 910. Nice. Perfect. Yeah, we need to get to this. We need to get to this 910 spot. Five is real nice. Perfect. Red's, red's coming though. Look out for red. Um, this helps, but we do need to start taking the road here. Or at least start thinking about it. All right. Nine. Okay, that's fine. Um, we're going to take the old three for one. Can we get a wheat? Not this. No, okay, it's fine. Um, we'll do a little. We'll do the trade. Do the port trade. Take this port. I will hold. We're at seven. We're close. We're close. Despite us screwing up early on, we're close. That is huge. Okay, we get a four or three. We can retake, we could take the road, which would be big. 
We have a city in hand. What are they playing? You're plenty. Ooh. Ooh, nine points. Okay. All right. That's a road. Helpful. Uh oh. All right. Got to work a little bit harder, but we're okay with that temporarily. Okay. Could be at seven points here. Look out. Could be at seven. Oh man. How close are they? Oh man. Okay. Two. All right. Slows them down. Eight. We buy three cards here. Hmm. I tend to agree. Um, I'm going to buy cards. Road Builder's nice. Um, okay. It's something. Got to be careful. That nine's a great roll. We can take the road back with that, which is nice. Does he have it, though? He might. Doesn't have it yet. Okay. Eight. Man. Don't think you could be too cute here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Yeah, he can kind of max out at eight. Two. We get a brick. No one's gonna take it. Two for one. Who's this? Red, two for one. Does that help us? Mm. No, it doesn't. We have two roads, so let's let's get the roads. We're doing it backwards again. God damn it! Okay. Do this. All right, something. Staving them off, staving them off. We're at nine. We just need a settle or a city. We're close. We're close. Amazingly, we're still close. That's not good. That's not good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Potentially a 10. City there. Okay. That's big. What else rolled? Rem's got wood. Oh, no. The Woodopoly. Oh, man. Look at that. Bravo, dude. A woodopoly. Wow. Okay, we gotta be careful though. This this could be a road builder for all we know. Yellow yellow's been kind of the silent player in this game. Uh <laughs> so that's that's all they did with it though, huh? Alright. Um Tough here. Oh, man. Mm. 
was really hoping for the road there. Didn't get it. <laughs> wanted a wood back. Wanted a wood back. Wanted a wood back. <laughs> yeah. Too late for me, unfortunately. It's okay. Well, I see that now. <laughs> it's okay. All right. Yeah, maybe not the best placement there, but all right, we survive a turn from red. See, this is what scares me, though. He might be able to take it back, win the game. Well, he he can't actually with the road, because road's gonna have to go this way. Oh man, can we win this? I did want the wood back, but. Man, this is this is a tough one, guys. This is a tough one. Despite us botching this early on. Wow, if we could survive a huge error like this. Uh oh. He's trying to get the road. I I okay. He's trying to alright, yeah, he's trying to go he's trying to go the road the other way. Okay. Army, okay. That's game unless something happens. All right, I got to think about this. We're rolling. Damn it. Oh, no. He's got sheep. All right. One, two, three. We're going to win. We're going to win. We're going to win because we know he's got cheap. And we're going to play our knight. And we're just going to steal it back. We got it, guys. We got it. That's all we needed. Oh, my God. What a break. Huh. Wow. Jeez. Oh, man. I totally botched that earlier. I cannot believe we won that game after screwing that up earlier. But, oh, man, we pulled, we pulled it off despite a complete disaster early on. Wow. Huh. Got a little bit of a heart palpitation from that one, guys. Wild, wild game. I got to say, um... It's funny, I, I thought we were in the best position in the beginning to win this. Um, I really did. I really did. But didn't quite happen. What I'm a little confused about. Let me think about this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, they couldn't have gotten it anyway. One, two, three, four. I, I'm just wondering why they bothered to connect there. I mean, I don't know. I probably need to try to run this way. Wow. Cannot believe we survived that. There were a lot of threes that game, I'll say that. Um, yeah, eight threes, jeez. Oof. But hey, that's what, you know, we did the right thing, putting it on those two spots. Highest production. Hey, highest production wins sometimes, guys. Highest production wins. Look at the wheat. You know what's funny? I feel like wheat was the one thing we had the least of in some ways, but it was actually the most rolled uh, resource, which was interesting. Yeah, we did a good job buying those three cards. That saved our butt in the end, right? Having that extra knight, even with the seven, and tracking blue here to make sure he had the, the sheeps for the three-for-one port, did the trick. Did the trick. Oh, man, I cannot believe we pulled that off. Wild. Absolutely wild game. Um, I still can't believe it. Okay, yeah, and we did good on the production there. 86. We did lose quite a bit here. What's on the sevens? How many did we lose on the sevens there? Yeah, we, we lost 14. Mostly because of that crazy... Uh, or I still can't believe that. Man, that's still, it's still killing me that we completely botched. Oh, man. Can, can we... Can we uh, unbelievable. I'm just happy we won, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.